<laughs> Best Uber ever. Just landed in Tampa and I asked my dad if I could drive because I miss driving. What's up guys? Welcome back hey, to my channel. Well, welcome hey to dad. Florida. Thank you. Welcome say home. say hi. Say what you need to say. Hi girls. And boys. And boys. Just came to Tampa for a few days. I was at a wedding for my friend. And I was like, I'm already gonna be down south, so let's go visit the fam. Um, and my dad lives somewhere new now. He lives at our house now, again. Yes. <laughs> so we're gonna go check it out. I like to do 15 year cycles. <laughs> so I get to drive my dad's I lived there for 15. Car. I've been gone for 15, now I'm back. This guy's like, you guys need to leave. Um, I am so excited. I was just like, I love driving in the evening and I love your car, so. Okay, okay. Here we go. Sunshine. Hello. I'm so excited because now that my dad lives here, he has a Keurig, and I love having Keurig coffee in the morning. And he got me decaf pods, and then also my favorite decaf coffee pods because decaf coffee unfortunately they use chemicals to make it decaffeinated but this one the no fun joe they use the swiss water method to make it decaf instead of chemicals i guess so it's better for you my dad just left for an appointment me and finley are hanging out and i found on youtube it's like an hour and a half long of Taylor Swift 1989 piano version, like someone someone else is playing it. And it's so relaxing. My dad, it's so funny, like our fridge is so different because it's like stuff my dad buys. And he bought me these Starbucks sous vide egg bites, I think from Costco, which is so cute. So I'm gonna make some of these for breakfast. He also was like, I got your dessert. I'm not like the biggest dessert person, but these actually look pretty good. It's so funny seeing like little changes my dad made. Like he bought these, which are really comfy on your feet if you're like washing the dishes and stuff. But for years, we've never had any mats here. So like I'm walking and I forget and I keep dripping on them because the house had like, we didn't have these before. <laughs> Wait, I feel like this is literally what they have at Starbucks. This is so funny. Pop these guys in the plate. Welcome to Starbucks. Finley can smell these. <laughs> it says air fryer recommended, but we don't have one. So I'm gonna microwave for 90 seconds, like it said. These look fire. I don't remember them being this big. I don't get them a lot, but they look really hot, but they look good, I'm excited. This is the problem when I come home, I don't wanna leave because I just wanna sit with Finley all day. <laughs> So he'd hang out with me. <laughs> Just lit a candle. I'm gonna take my morning supplements. There's a lot of them. What day of the week is it? Monday. Ooh, got all my vitamins here. I've been really enjoying taking my Symbiotic Plus from Ritual. But yeah, we've got a whole. I have to take them in a couple gulps here. Ah. Woo! 
three gulps. <laughs> I have my water from the airport, so I think I'm just going to make an element electrolyte mix because I want to go for a long walk. I want to get in the sauna later, so I feel like I need to hydrate, especially after traveling. I've been waiting to wear this set that I just got from IVL Collective because it's just a little too chilly in Florida now, or in Florida, in New York. This tank top looks like it's going to fit really nicely and be really good quality. And then I got this skirt also. It has like little scalloped bottoms and it's just perfect, guys. It's going to be like 86 degrees outside. I'm like, I could put on a bathing suit. This set is so cute. I'm wearing a small on the top, medium in the bottom. My spray tan is like fading away though. Well, because I self tanned over it and it's looking pretty gross. But the set is very cute. I just slicked back my hair with some, like, I put like Divi hair serum or scalp serum on. And then I have on these Peter Thomas Roth eye patches and they feel amazing. Currently going through stuff my dad brought over from his house because his place is all empty now. This is his house now. Um, I forgot I had this backpack it's from the brand Madeline and Company. I don't know if they exist anymore, but if they do, like this backpack is so cute. It was like during my preppy era, but like... I love it. I don't want to give it away. Like, I, I want it. It's so cute. Um, but, yeah, I have, like, my old cheerleading uniform. This is, like, one of my first pieces of merch ever. She believes she could, so she did. Danielle Murray, because I used to not say my last name. My old flip camera. Like, I, I want, I'm going to try and charge this and see what I can do. I forget if this is even how you charge it, honestly. I feel like this is so you can plug it into your computer and upload the files. But this was, like, the shit. Um, I also didn't know I had this Hot Tools curling iron at my dad's house. And this is really nice. This is a great size. So I was like, wait, bring that over. I want to try it. Just made another cup of coffee. I love this cup <laughs> that I have from years ago. It's called Business Bitch. I love it. Finley's still back there. I'm going to do some stuff for the podcast, respond to some emails. And then I need to go outside. <laughs> distracted and now i'm on the zara website because i saw someone on tiktok got these and i'm just obsessed with sling back heels in general so i got like a black patent like heel i just think it looks so chic under a pair of jeans and then i'm also getting so they're called the patent effect sling back heels on zara i hate shopping on zara online but we're doing it and then i'm also getting these for more like everyday wear i hope they're comfortable they don't have a lot of sizes left so go 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 but um these are the slingback kitten heels and they're so chic. So I'm gonna go buy those now and then we're gonna go for a walk. have barely made it past the park and Finley's already ready to go back come on <laughs> come on buddy it's okay oh my gosh he said he's done he's done I dropped Finley off and kept walking because we barely made it <laughs> so I'm just listening to a podcast getting my daily walk workout in I'm learning that whatever fits for you to get that activity in works and for right now recently it's been walking so i'm gonna lean into that guys it's literally 86 degrees out here it's so hot i didn't i i wasn't planning on putting on a bathing suit but i totally could finley's entertaining himself quite nicely <laughs> the sun feels so good on my skin the uv is like five I, th I don't think it's getting much higher than seven and usually in the summer here it gets up to 10 or 11 but I'm just soaking it in and then in like 20 minutes, I'm going to go meet my mom at our favorite juice spot and get some juices and then we're going to go get pedicures. Today is such a leisurely day. I'm like not used to doing something like this on a Monday. Like obviously I work from home and I work for myself and I have an amazing schedule, but normally I'm still very much on or I'm doing things and I'm kind of just like rolling with the day. And that's half the reason I come home. I just kind of slow down and it's really nice. Welcome to the car. Going to meet my mom. 
I'm in my dad's car. I really like driving it. I forgot how nice it is. Um, I love the brown interior. It kind of reminds me of my old Volvo. May she rest in peace. Well, she's still with us. She's just with someone else and it's fine. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go get a smoothie, a juice, I don't really know. They have really good coffee there. And then maybe pedicures, but also maybe not. Cause I'm like, should I come out, come back and go outside and enjoy the sunshine? Not sure yet. Look who it is. Oh we went to get pedicures and a mother-daughter duo walked in right before us so we got to go back in an hour <laughs> yes but don't worry because danielle will figure out stuff for us to do in the meantime <laughs> i was like let's go run errands so, so we're gonna go to sephora because she said she needed something what are you gonna get i've been wearing that super goop tinted moisturizer and i love it because glow screen oh yeah is that what it is it. okay i don't know i guess it i wouldn't call it tinted moisturizer okay Whatever it is, but I wear it and people say, oh wow, your skin looks great. Makes you look glowy. And that's all I wear, so. And I'm going to see if they have some self-tan eraser because my self-tan is just coming off in a really weird way and it's making me uncomfortable. So. Yeah, you need to scrub it off. I know. I'm just going to see what tools they have and hopefully I will only leave with that. But this is a really nice new Sephora. So. It is. It's inside of a Kohl's, which I think is kind of cool. I know. Kohl's, I, I shop. I, you know what they do? They give you a coupon. When you're in there, and then for oh, percentage no, off of Kohl's, they also, you can return your Amazon packages here in the back, and then when you do that, they give you a coupon, and then you can shop. Isn't that smart? There's, they, they're they doing something right. No, they get you in there, and I wouldn't normally come to Kohl's, but because I go to Sephora and the Amazon return place, you I'm, find yourself shopping around. I do, around. and there's some cute things oh, in there. That's exciting. Well, we'll see what we find. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> this is cute whatever this is all the fall 50% off some doormats happy fall oh my gosh this is sold out everywhere in New York it's the peppermint Laneige lip balm so obviously I'm gonna get it because it literally was sold out at the Sephora near me I'm gonna get this stuff because it's multi-purpose, but it also is really good for exfoliating self-tan off. Mom's trying to decide which glow screen to get, but she's gonna do sunri sunrise. Golden hour is a little darker. Yes. It's exciting. Woo! Oh, no. it's it. Wake up! <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Guys, oh, the my. funniest <laughs> thing just happened. <laughs> I was like, you know what? I should stop by the dentist. I need more of, I use this, so fancy, um, <laughs> fluoride toothpaste, because I'm cavity prone. And if you guys know, you know, there's a whole funny story, like, I mean, there's multiple stories to my dentist. I drink, for a while, I was drinking lots of sparkling water, acidic drinks, like, um, kombucha. kombucha, lots of ginger shots. I mean, I still take ginger shots, but, Anyways, I wasn't really being mindful of my teeth and my teeth and animal starting to weaken and I was starting to get potential cavities up front. Anyway, so now I've been going to dentists like every three months, but just to like check them because I don't want to get the, my front teeth filled because mm -hmm. it could like change how they look or whatever. Mm -hmm. But also I don't want them to get to my nerve and I don't want to get a root, can root canal. So anyways, mm -hmm. I walk in there and I'm like, hey, I'm a patient. I'm, I don't have an appointment today. I'm just um, wanting to pick up some more fluoride toothpaste. Literally the dentist. The dentist. Dr. C came out? Yes. He emerges. He like heard my voice. He's like, Danielle, Aww. so good to see you. No, it was Aww. so, I know. He's so, the best. He's so nice. And he was like, we were trying to get a hold of you last week. And I guess I missed the call. And he was like, I've been thinking about you. I was like, oh my God, that's so nice. He was like, I know you're coming in next month, but I don't know. There's some patients that I'm like thinking about and I, I do you have five minutes? Can we go take a quick x-ray and see how your teeth are doing? Because I saw him last time I saw him was in February. Cause I missed my like every three, I like missed the one in the summer. Well, no, actually I saw them over the summer, but the last x-ray I took was in February or right. something. Okay. And so he was like, do you have five minutes? I was like, I guess so. So I, I, we literally took one x-ray in my front teeth. And I was so nervous. He was like, I just really, like, it would just give me peace of mind. I was like, that is so nice. That's why it's worth it for you to come home. I know. That's there. why I don't go to New York City dentists. Because your hometown um, dentists care about you. Yeah. I'm sure there's good dentists Not in New, New York, York City, City as a whole. But, like, that's why I, yeah. But sorry. he's taking care of you for a while. 
Yes, and I was like, all right, so I was nervous, and they haven't grown. Nice. Like, like truly, he was like, I fully was expecting to see them like be worse, and I was Yay. like, no, you. I have been drinking. I mean, I still drink sparkling water, but I've been drinking more of the like low pH sparkling water that you buy special on Amazon. Oh. I drink way less kombucha. If I do drink, then I try to rinse my water after or rinse my mouth with water. So I'm really happy to hear that because he was like, those could have grown, so that's good. Like there is a chance they could solidify. Anyways, you guys don't care about all this, but that's I just awesome. basically got a dentist sneak attack. He literally was like, can you come in really quick? But then I was like, oh, am I going to have to pay for this? I didn't say that. And I went to go buy the toothpaste because that's why I came. And he was like, professional courtesy. Like, uh, I know. Oh, well, because I feel like good. if he's like, I want to take you for an x-ray, like, that'd be kind of like. Yeah, he was just. He literally it was, was like, like serendipitous that you yeah. walked in. It was so. really sweet. I feel bad. I didn't realize they called me last week. I thought it was just to confirm, you know, You're... that I'm coming next month. So anyways, uh, that was just so sweet. Anyways. That's awesome. Yeah. All right, Freddie and I are going to get in the sauna. New addition to the house. My dad got a cold plunge. I don't know if I'll, I'm not a big cold plunge person myself. Oh, my gosh. It just looks cold. Like, wow. But it does, however, look incredible. It's more of, like, my mom, dad, and brother like to do it. I don't like the sauna to the cold plunge. Maybe I would do the cold plunge on, like, its own. I mean, it looks really nice at the sauna, though, I have to say. So we're going to get in the sauna for a little bit. Sun's starting to come down. We're going to get a family dinner. Here we go. She's toasty. Very toasty. All right, I haven't been in a sauna in a minute, so this feels really nice. Woo, hot. Oh my God. That is crazy. You're staying in? Oh my God. Like, I like the idea of it, but... Woo. Back in the sauna now. Turned on the red light. Getting a little red light therapy and watching the sunset. Can't complain. Sunset is so pretty tonight. Going to dinner with wet hair. We're going to one of my favorite Mexican restaurants. I'm so excited. Felt so good to shower after the sauna. Um, I'm just wearing this tank top from Cezanne. Jeans are from Julia Haven's Windsor collection. I really like them. Bottega bag. And these are actually Bottega sandals. Um, I've just been loving wearing like a tank and jeans. I think it's cute, casual. I hate that I'm wearing wet hair. I'm going to bring my mini um, hairbrush, my little mini tangle teaser because my hair is just going to keep drying throughout the night and this thing does wonders for my hair. And I'm also bringing my new Laneige peppermint lip balm, but I don't have it on right now because Too Faced is one of like the only brands that still sends PR to the house. So I get excited when I come home because I always have new Too Faced. So I tried this lip injection and my lips are stinging, but my lips look good. I just did skincare, um, like some vitamin C serum, eye cream, some brows, brushed up my lashes. <laughs> wow, there's blonde Danny. Here's dirty blonde Danny. <laughs> Dad wanted attention, so he got the fajitas. This is another headfish here. Stopped by my dad's house because he's moved out officially. Oh, he didn't take this off. Um, this was my room here. It was quite lovely. Uh, a lot of memories here. I mean, he's had this for like a really long time. I made a lot of my first YouTube videos in this house. At the vanity right here. I don't know if any of you guys really remember it. I didn't sleep here a lot, but yeah, saying goodbye. We're out back now. Came to check out the dock light. Freddie claims he sees some tarpon in the outskirts. I don't, but if you look close enough, at times the little fish will fly, fly, swim over the light. So I'm just waiting for some fishies. Oh, I see fish. See? There's a fishy. I don't know if you guys can see. Fish right there. Fish. I see fish. Can you guys see the fish? There's a fishy. Yeah. 
cookies out here. I see the pancakes. When you see like flat pancake waves above the ocean, it usually means there's manatees. Of course, now that we came out here, I think they're going that way. They were over here. They're all big. Wow. Can you guys see that? There's so many fish. Oh, dolphins. Yeah, dolphins. Dolphins. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. He's going to come over here and eat these, hopefully. Oh my god, guys, we're in direct view. Okay, shh. Is it gonna come here? Oh, holy shit. Oh my god. Finley is so confused. Just spent the last two hours getting some work done. Just said goodbye to Freddie. He's off on a work business trip. So I'll see him next month for Thanksgiving. I'm still wearing this shirt because I love it. Put on some leggings and sneakers and a hat. We're going to go for our daily walk. I'm going to bring Finley. We're going to see how far he'll go. Then I might have to bring him back and I'll keep walking. <laughs> Finley, want to go for a walk? <sighs> He's such a teenager. Currently playing this like jazzy Paris thing on YouTube. Finley, you want to go for a walk? You want to go for a walk? We go outside? It literally looks so nice outside. Come on, Finley, we have to go. All right, we'll go back. We'll go back. Yeah, oh, now you got some pep in your step. Just showered and like quickly got ready. I'm not even wearing foundation. I just did like concealer. Um, a lot of concealer though. <laughs> and then I didn't really know what to do with my hair. So we did half a pep down. My mom and I are having a day in Tampa today. I'm so excited. Here's the outfit. I love this dress. It's from House of CB. And I just knew I had to bring it down because the weather was still warm enough here for me to wear it. I also think it'd be cute to wear in New York with like a blazer over top. And then just like my everyday jewelry. This watch bracelet is from Electric Picks some gold earrings, necklace, and then I'm just wearing sneakers to be comfortable. And then we're gonna do this white bag from By Far. got to Hyde Park and there's so many new restaurants and uh, stores here. Like this looks so cute, boozy. Every time I come back to Hyde Park, there's new stores. Like there's a Sephora here now, a Sweet Green apparently. I'm shook. Got an iced latte to go. Oxford Exchange is fabulous. Shout out to all the sweet subscribers and podcast listeners I met while we were sitting there. I mean, it makes sense because if there's one thing I say about Tampa, it's go to Oxford Exchange. Yeah. But that was so cool. Mom's in her brown era. She's coming to the Austin and Chicago show. She's like, I need a hat for Austin and a bag for Chicago. <laughs> no, I really, I will be stealing that bag, so. And the hat is so cute. I love that, I like a sturdy hat. Going to see my mom's condo for the first time. Finley, do you know where we are? This table and chair situation, mom, it's so cute. I love the console. That's so cute. I mean, this balcony is magical. I feel like I'm in Outer Banks or something. This is literally your oasis. You're in nature. Wow. I am obsessed with Harry Jowsey and Riley Arnold. 
And they're about to perform on Dancing with the Stars. Here we go. <sighs> Yay. Oh, fun song. Go, Harry. He's really come a long way, too. He really? Was... Oh, I mean, you can say. All right, Finley, it's our last sleep together. He always starts on the bed, and then within, like, ten minutes, he goes to his own bed. But, yeah, cozy night. It was so cute seeing my mom's new condo it really did have good vibes and i really liked it the guest room they're like starting to work on and it was lovely and their view was just so i felt like i was in the outer banks i don't know how to explain it. i felt like i was in this coastal beach cottage so i'm really happy for them and it's exciting for them to have their own space and if you guys don't understand why my mom doesn't live here anymore my dad does go watch my one of my last videos it's like a life update video parents moving that's in the title and that'll explain everything. Um, but yeah, tomorrow's my last day. I don't leave till the evening. So I'm going to go. My dad has to work again tomorrow. So I kind of just said goodbye to him now. And then tomorrow my mom and I are going to go for a long walk. I'm going to do some laundry because I like to leave with all clean clothes. And just enjoy one last little Florida day. I hope this vlog is entertaining. But you guys like when I vlog at home. So I don't know. Outfit of the day. Gonna head over to my mom's condo. I'm gonna bring Finley and we're gonna go for a walk. Her couch is getting delivered today, so I'm gonna be there with her. So I'm just bringing, she said to bring a bathing suit because she's like, maybe we'll go to the beach or the pool. I'm like, this is very, um, what's the word? <clears throat> it's a lofty goal because I have to be back here to pack up to go to the airport at like 4 30. But I guess we do have the whole day. So we'll see. But um, yeah, I'm just wearing. Go to hot girl walk fit. Let's go. All right. We're now in my mom's car. We have cars all over the place. Shuffling around. I got Finley here with me. We're gonna do a quick drive to my mom's. And we're gonna put the top down. It's okay, buddy. Our last dog used to love the car. And Finley like, just gets confused by the car. Like, our last dog used to love putting her head out the window and all that, and now I feel like... This is so fun! Uh... Okay. I got a little Duncan for the road. Finley, what do you think? Finley loves his water fountain. I love that they do this for dogs. That's so nice. Mom needed to take a dip. And Finley is not loving this. Good boy, Finley. Good boy. Ready? Steady. Polar plunge. She's doing her little cold plunge. You got this. Finley's so worried. Finley. There she goes. Alright, mom's showing us some things she bought for Chicago and Austin. We have the hat and the bag. Finley's here for the fashion show too. Oh my gosh! Stunning! I love a pointed toe. Oh, I love it. I thought it was leopard. I like it better that it's tortoise. Yeah. That's cute. Wait, I'm obsessed. You're so cute. This is you're gonna be styling and profiling at these live shows. So good. I mean, where do you get it from? Exactly. Mom, know. this no. is so it. perfect in Chicago. I know. We're gonna have the best time. Can you believe the that? brown, and then you can hold your brown clutch. Express really did it up I mean, at International Mall. Yeah. So fun. Yeah. 
Mom, this is so cute. Isn't that I love. Do you have a pair of tall boots? No, but I bet you do. Didn't you leave your Stuart Weissman's here? Yeah. <laughs> then she just tucked that bag like, okay, ma'am. I was like, I gotta film again. <laughs> Finley's like not even paying attention to the ball. Well, now he is because I said okay. something. But well, he's so see, into the I fits. I did the whole brown thing. Look at this little sweater. Oh, yeah. Layer underneath. underneath it. It's perfect, my mad. And then wait. There's more. Oh, oh my gosh. Express as well? Yeah. Oh, I love. I'm obsessed. Yeah. Like, this all goes together, too. I did that. Definitely. That's a whole moment. And you can wear them separately, too, obviously. Yeah. That's exciting. Yeah. Love. Yeah. I really like these, these a lot. These are so comfortable. Like, yeah, they pants. feel really nice. Well, they fit well in the waist. I love they're when that happens. Crotchy. Crotchy. I mean, they're... That's the only reason I kind of looked at them. <laughs> and he's like, what are you guys looking at? I don't know. With the cowboy hat on top? I mean, why not, right? Could I do that, too? Yeehaw! <laughs> well, that's a wrap for my Tampa trip. I'll be back pretty soon for Thanksgiving. I have to go say goodbye to Finley now, which is my least favorite part. So I'm gonna go. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!